that GD slash. If it's not Genesis 6, then it's G6. Guys, there's, no, there's only so many ways you can spell out history here, and it's those two. So be sure to follow the bracket, follow the journey. And, of course, Fall was about to go down here in this match, man. Tweak versus Shoot Tone as we jump right into game number one. This is actually what put Shoot Tone into losers, too, by the way. Don't forget, uh, Shoot Tone was put into losers by Voids. Uh, Voids Wolf. So now we're going to see if he's able to, or if he's going to get into put out of this tournament by another one, or is this even going to last that long? You know, as I said, man, Tweak can play so many, pilot so many characters at such a high level. All right, let's see if he can persevere here. Hey, this one isn't starting out so hot for him, but again, you know, you know how quickly, uh, you know, you see how quickly Wolf adds up that damage, man. Just one quick interaction and one read off that, and now he's got a slight lead in the percent, and he's got the stage advantage. You are absolutely correct. There's the down throw right there, a small percent here between both these two players, but that small percent honestly can make all the difference here in the long run. Shuton, alleviating the pressure, backing up here, hitting him with the red one. He has the blue one and the yellow one online. He wants to keep that blue one back, tucked close in his, uh, in, in his uh, utility belt. Because he knows that there's going to be an opportunity where he's going to be able to go for a grab. Hey, man. Beast him up right there. Say, you know what? Step back. Right, step back, step back. I got the taser on deck. Yes. So shoot zone, man. I mean, both these guys super high up on, on percent, obviously. Uh, at this point in time, you're going to start seeing some more smashes coming out for shoot zone. That's how he's going to get that stock. Possibly a, oh, okay, so I was, possibly a purple upper back air. That's what I was going to say. But he, as soon as, he, as, soon as I, I'm, I'm thinking of it, he's doing it. That's right, man. You're definitely tapped into Cerebro, if I may say so myself. Too bad I can't tap into my own Cerebro. Anyway, well, <laughs> that gone, man. <laughs> All right, stay, with, stay in the light, TK. Come on, man. All right, now with this in mind, shoot time is 169% here. And though, you know, the percent obviously is not the best position here to be in in the world, I mean, he is still rocking and rolling here. Almost, he's completely, well, I ain't going to say he's complete, but he's working on lapping my man Tweak. Back throw, back throw yeah, that's going to do it. Yeah, yeah man, Tweak. Find, find a really good way to, to keep his back to the ledge, but also still pressure his opponent. So instead of having like stand there and then roll in and try to get the grab, he's like straight up just like, hold up. Uh, what if I do this down there so close that once you stand up, like I'm right here? Yeah. Oh, okay. wait. We'll, okay. We'll flash. I'm back in here. I think he, he he got the sweet spot, but I think it ran into, did it look like it ran into a Pikmin? I think that's what happened here because I didn't see all of them take any damage. Oh, no, he took some damage. Oh, did he? Okay. Yeah, he took a little damage. It just, it just wasn't super crazy damage, so or he, he didn't get like the spike hitbox or anything. It's not odd. Damage. You see Wolf go for something crazy here. Like, did that even happen because it didn't put on a lot of damage? Like, I don't know. Okay, yep, trying to get the dash attack, but uh, she's on. I think maybe expecting him to jump out of there. Spot dodge first into the uh, into the neutral air is gonna go ahead and push it back away. Shuto now gonna opt to go ahead and throw some more of these Pikmin. Yeah, gonna find find a way to add some of this collateral damage to this next up air that hits with or, or next aerial honestly that just hits with this uh, purple should Ooh, be the last one. That's right, man. My man Tweak sharking off stage here. Okay, Shuto very well aware of how uh -oh. beautiful his yeah. recovery can be at times. Goes to snap Les, but unfortunately it matters not at this point. Tweak has a very slight lead, but a lead nonetheless. And as you know, Tweak doesn't need much room to make magic happen, but neither does Shuto. I want to know what tweet, if Tweak was coming back on stage with neutral air or forward air, but it didn't seem to matter, man. Shutan said, I got both of those covered. That's right, Even mama. if you, you coming in on the stage empty, it's getting it's getting thrown down. That's right, man. He gives himself that ultimate assurance needed. There's the up smash up close and personal. I almost lost track of where that purple one was. Oh, damn. Okay, hold on. Look at the wall right here. Oh, he's, he's in the blender right now. We got loot. Yeah, he couldn't get his own forward air. It's a roll. Uh, yeah, the roll on on stage, man. Roll on in this game a little faster. Uh, thus being a little harder to... To uh, react to, so <laughs> sometimes a great option, man. It's, it, anytime you see a roller get blown up, I feel like usually it's a read instead of a reaction. Now, uh oh, okay. I like the spot dodge right there. The B reverse off the platform again, man. I really like these neutral special options here from Tweet. Okay, has the yellow one on deck. Look for that well. active hitbox to give him an opening, but doesn't matter though. Tweet again with another forwarder. Ooh, okay, just barely. Back here as well. For, oh, okay. Wow, I'm, I'm, I am so surprised he got that uh, that tech, but he then took the whole chest out right there, man. He broke the helmet, he broke the chest, all of that. Let me get that, boy. Yeah, I don't know if this is Smash the Commentator or Mortal Kombat. Yeah, that's what Mortal Kombat. Let me right. get that. It's Kodo Khan right there, man. Oh, man. All right, so good stuff to Tawik taking that game. I mean, that was. Whoo. Every game I see with Shoot on ends up getting scary. Yes, it gets scary and it gets scarier, too. That's And that's the scary part about it, man. Like, they just they could become closer and closer. Tweak's very much used to getting the lead, and then, of course, when he has the lead, holds on to it for dear life. He doesn't let go, but yeah. right now he is met with this fantastic player named Shuton. Shuton still has a lot of tricks up his sleeve, and his manageability of the Pikmin is definitely shining through for him here in this matchup. All right, dog. Let's move into this next game right here. Game number two. Tweak goes up one game, and this is Shuton's game to try to bring this thing back. Is this, is this really the answer to Olimar, though? Like, is this really the, the answer? Is Wolf really the answer? I... I wouldn't be upset if it was, man. I mean, I get it, man. Mercenary for hire, what's up? Or, right. Or, or, or I guess uh, Fitch for hire, so. As long as he's making money, that's all he cares about. Yeah. 
All right. Now, a good low percent right here to kind of kick things off here. 20 seconds to this ma uh, match. We kind of had a tame start, if I may say so myself. You know, that last match started out very, very rough. It was kind of a slugfest almost. Like, something you see out of fight night. But here, though, Tweet saying a little bit more calm, cool, collected. Shootan can say the exact same for himself, too. Uh-oh. What look, you doing? Look at his movement out here, though, man. He's, the way he's dropping these neutral layers on him every time. Uh, the way he's actually using these, this platform arrangement to kind of get away from Shuto trying to go, go for some of these hard reads. Thought he, he thought he was going to get himself an S match there. He caught, him, caught himself uh, charging it up. Yes. My man Tweet was on that top platform just looking. He was up there for a minute, wasn't he? Up there enjoying, oh, no enjoying all the other battlefields from Smash games prior in the background. That's what all that is back there. Wait, is that for real? Straight up. That's canon. I, wait, for real? Swear I never me. knew that, dog. Swear <laughs> to me, mom. All right, man. Anyway, all, all, all my man's in them. <laughs> all, all my man's. <laughs> I'm tapping into my inner anti here. My my, my inner right. tri state. Oh wait. Okay. Yeah. You, what stays checking is second nature when you play characters like Wolf, Fox, and Falco. You yeah. got to know how to do it on the fly. Okay. Quick shots, but nothing uh really popping off for him right there. Uh oh. Okay. Trying to space with the backer. He has double purple plus the red. So he's going to get a little bit close. Okay, but not too close, obviously. Tweet very well aware that of that. He's using these platforms to his advantage. He's mixing them up. Some platforms he's landing on. Some of them he's just jumping through. Shoot time can't quite keep tabs on him here. Okay, looking for yet another back here, but could not find it. Man, shoot on, yeah, shoot on is trying. Uh, well, I would say he's trying desperately to find something to get something started for himself. I'm surprised he was going for so many back airs, uh, you know, this early on. That's right. But I, I, I looked down to the percent that he was trying to get a KO at first, how many, as many purple back airs as he was throwing out. That's right, man. He has the Lakers right now. He got Kobe and he got Shaq. What must he's about to do? Man, let's just do that, though. Uh oh. That's a timeout. That's right. You definitely got. Yes. He's, yeah, man, that's yeah. That's, he's, that's, that's Phil Jackson right there, yeah. man. He's built like Phil Jackson. That's for sure. No, I'm, I'm joking. That's messed Dang. up. But anyway, though, <laughs> there's the down throw right there, man. Can't quite get the tech read, but does find the opening for the back air. Taking these platforms away from just in case he decides to recover high. There, it's always an awkward position when Olivar's toss off stays. He has to decide very early on if he wants to go for the ledge or if he wants to go for the platform on stages like Battlefield. Shuton, I mean, all, all I think Shuton's trying to do is find a way to get back on the stage. Finally does it with this Soul Pikmin. Didn't even decide to pick anymore yet. There he is, finally uh, picks his boys, calls the party. Okay. Set us on tonight. All right. Here we are. Balls off the top platform there with that back air. I like that, you know. Um, back air is a, a very strong tool for Wolf. Obviously, it can it can combo, but it also has the ability to KO, too. It's some very, very crazy percents there. And same could be said, though, for Nair. Hell, same could be said for anything that Wolf does sometimes. There's, there's a lot to be said here. That's right. Okay, gets the scoop. Back throw. Oh Jesus. Get, get flung. A lot to be said, but unfortunately, what's understood doesn't need to be explained sometimes, man. We've seen what that back throw has done since Wolf has been added back here into Smash Ultimate. Okay, here we go. We're getting some, we're getting some damage out here. Ooh. Okay, I like that Wolf there. Alleviated some of that pressure. He's backing off. Oh, wait. Okay, the spot dodge into the pivot grab. Yeah, this time, I guess he you know, wasn't trying to throw out the up throw yet. Obviously, it wasn't uh, at that point. Mm. Okay. Another spot dodge, too, man. He's very uh, very ballsy play style here from Shuton. You know, we, we get, uh, not you and I, but, you know, sometimes a lot of people get so wrapped up in, in the defensive gameplay that Omar brings to the table that we kind of sleep on the fact that he has some pretty good frame that are up close and personal. Oh, okay. Got the, oh, he was, he was expecting a roll. He was he was easily expecting a roll or some type of defensive option. Tweak, tweak, not giving it to him. He said, you know what, I'm actually going to go ahead and attack as you're running into me. That's right, so, that's mine. So we finally get the stock off from Shoe Tone. Uh, this is where he can start to get some of these early percent combos. Man, if he gets an up smash this early on, you can see that easily leading to an up air, possibly even two, depending on his platform arrangement. Right. Uh oh. 111% here. He's starting to cook. Taking a Oh, that was his opportunity to strike right there. A little early on the trigger there with the up smash. Oh, again, another up smash attempt. I hope he hasn't shown his hand too early. Even when up smash being such a, a quick move, he was able to get that grab right after. That's right. He's like, yeah, I might have whiffed, but honestly, I'm still getting. <gasps> oh, man, if that was the spike, that would have been a crazy ending to this game. Luckily for Tweak, man, did not get the spike hitbox and he lived to see another day. Mm -hmm. That's up here off of the ledge. Look at this comeback from Shuton. God now damn. Okay, that yeah, get off, get away from that. I say this whole game now in kind of into his favor as far as the stage uh, uh, control goes. He tries to cross him up with the back. Did you see how smooth he's moving? Out into the magnifying glass he goes, saves his jump, and then gets the tech. No way, no way, ladies he's, and he's gentlemen. Actually, he's actually, I feel like he he knew, he knew exactly what was about to happen there. He knew he needed the tech jump into the side B back. Or what you think you're doing? I feel bad for Shuton because you know, in, in another life. And another hitbox, that game was over. In a parallel universe, you're most definitely correct. All right. Wow. That was definitely Shuton's time to shine. I hope he hasn't expended too much energy. 
I hope he didn't give it all he's got, man, because he still got one more game on deck for himself. That's a heartbreaker. That hurt. That's a, that's definitely a heartbreaker. Can we talk about Wolf's eye patch? How it's actually not strapped to anything? It's just a it's just a patch on the eye. That's just it's implanted into his skin, man. Who is he, Thor? Who do you think he is, man? He's got a patch on. All right, man. Anyway, though, moving and grooving into this next one, man. We could be is the final one here uh, for his shoot time, man. He gave it his all in that last game, man. But Tweet just took it from him, man. Right out of his hands, he was bully mode. Ooh. Okay. All right, yeah, quick down tilt, but. I know at these early percent sometimes they be looking for that trip. Doesn't, doesn't manage to get it right there. But right. even if they get like a a, a down tip, kind of later percent, though if it if it sets up it sets up for tech setup. Right. You know what I mean? It's super low altitude, so if you don't tech that or if you do tech that the wrong way, you're probably about to get blown up by that down smash next. Right. F tilt though. Here we are. Once more, push them far, far away. 102 percent. You know, even despite having a lot of percent online for himself, Shutan still doesn't mind getting up close on on Wolf. It's actually a testament to just how fearless he is of a player, man. A lot of players, once they get in that high percent range, they want to kind of back off, but then that's when Wolf switches into that neutral special. That's very true. Okay, yeah, dropping in on a look. Oh, wow, looks like that neutral player was actually safe enough. Uh, or, or Tweak might have been too late on the draw. I was like, maybe back throw on this platform just to check the DI. That's right, yeah, the blast zones are different on this iteration of yeah. Battlefield. You're right. I was actually thinking the same thing, yeah. Yeah, but instead he goes for the up throw, just gets the damage, puts it back into the sky. Stage control being a huge thing in this matchup. You want you. Obviously, Olimar kind of—I feel like he has a, a easier time kind of getting back because of this Pikmin uh, lifestyle that he that he has. You know, you have to spend time trying to get it off. Looks like Tweak didn't even care about that one. He's like, I know it's a white, but I, I'd rather I'd rather just take the damage and not uh, put myself in a bad position. Absolutely. As you see right here, kind of has him back into a corner, but he's coming out swinging like a corner possum here, man. Forty percent online, and he has to get back to where center stays. Man. He man, has to stay in that hub. That's where he does phenomenal work, as you see right there. My man said a corner possum. That's a real Midwest talk right that's there. That's anyway, right, Midwesterner, man. Yeah, he put it right there at the O2 barbecue. <laughs> All right, there, oh, there it is. Gets the grab after that as well, pushing him back off stage. Shoot on actually fighting back on double fair. Only got two, has only got two Pikmin on him. Looks like he throw, I don't know if he threw that. Yeah, I don't know if he actually threw that other blue away, but. No reason to have two blues uh, right now as far as like the greatest lineup if you're not about to go for the KO uh, throw. Uh -huh. Short hop in there, 83%. It's very difficult to do. Okay, so now instead of going for down smash, he's starting to read it because he's teching in place, standing right up. He's going for dash attack. Damn, I, I thought he actually got up there with another up air. I think that would have ta uh, taken that stock. Oh, yeah. But it was actually forward air this time around. The, the whistle tries to get the grab, but instead the air dodge behind him. And there was nothing he was able to do, so he ended up taking that F tilt. It was that is all she wrote. That's right, and it all comes down to ladies and gentlemen at home. Shoe time. One stock right now. Tweet cooking. Falls through the platform, looking to reset the situation. He, he with had the up it too. Just yeah. a, little, a little early on the fall there. Oh my. Oh my goodness. Okay, neutral special, good parry. Okay, let me slide into that. Slide into the DM. Mm -hmm. Gives himself a little extra hit as well uh, with that with that up air. Okay, he's starting to build up that fort. Okay, has a good combination right here. He has the yell to put on some damage. I like, blue, I like the space that, uh, that Tweak is showing. Too. Mm -hmm. uh, he's, he's down to play this platform until he throws his Pikmin on. He only has like one left on him. That's when he decides to try to go and explode. Uh -uh. Get him. Oh. Not enough. Okay. Oh my. Maybe one more that time. Is. There it is, man. Yeah, follow him as he's coming back down with that up air. But okay, and Tweak getting an F smash, pushing him off right as he comes through. Uh, I like that uh, recovery from True Tony. He got, he's only done it once. Oh, my God. He gets scooped up, but not enough. Not quite enough indeed. But if at first he don't succeed, you keep sharking. Beautiful stuff there to TSM Tweak. Sending Shootan back home. Unfortunately, I got to say.